Coke Freestyle Machines offer an extensive array of soda flavors, seemingly fulfilling every fizzy desire. However, even these innovative dispensers cannot resurrect the discontinued sodas of the past. The beverage industry, known for its creativity, has introduced a plethora of wild creations over the years, ranging from inventive concoctions to downright bizarre flavors. Despite the convenience of modern soda dispensers, nostalgic enthusiasts might yearn for the taste of bygone favorites that are no longer available. Exploring the history of discontinued sodas reveals a fascinating journey through the ever-evolving landscape of beverage innovations, where quirky and unconventional flavors once held a place in the hearts of consumers. Number one, Sprite Remix. Sprite Remix, the berry-flavored variant of the popular lemon-lime soda, gained widespread popularity in the early 2000s. Its unique and refreshing taste captured the attention of consumers, becoming a cultural phenomenon during that era. However, as time has passed, the availability of Sprite Remix has dwindled, leaving fans with nostalgia for a once-beloved beverage. In its heyday, Sprite Remix introduced a burst of berry flavors that offered a delightful twist to the traditional lemon-lime taste of the original Sprite. The vibrant colors and bold combination of fruity notes created a sensation, making it a sought-after choice for those looking to experience a different side of the iconic soda brand. Fast forward to the present, and Sprite Remix has become somewhat of a rarity. The beverage landscape has evolved and consumer preferences have shifted. As a result, the classic lemon-lime flavor has taken precedence, relegating Sprite Remix to the realms of cherished memories for those who enjoyed it during its peak. While Sprite Remix may not be as readily available on store shelves, its legacy lives on through the fond memories of those who relished its distinctive flavor. The evolution of beverage trends and the cyclical nature of consumer preferences often lead to the resurgence of nostalgic products. Perhaps in the future, we may witness a revival of Sprite Remix or similar innovative soda flavors that capture the essence of a specific time and captivate a new generation of taste buds. Number two, Hubba Bubba Soda, bubble gum flavored soda, an eccentric phenomenon from the 80s left many scratching their heads. Hubba Bubba Soda was a unique creation that embraced the unconventional, bringing together the nostalgic flavors of childhood bubblegum and the effervescence of soda. While the concept might seem perplexing at first glance, it reflects the bold and experimental spirit of the 80s, an era marked by innovation and daring in various aspects of popular culture. Introduced during the time when novelty beverages were gaining traction, Hubba Bubba Soda aim to capture the essence of a beloved childhood treat in liquid form. The soda promised a burst of bubblegum flavor with each sip, attempting to recreate the joyous experience of chewing gum. This unconventional beverage choice, however, faced its fair share of skepticism. The 80s were an era of audacious experimentation, not only in fashion and music, but also in the realm of consumer goods. Hubba Bubba Soda joined the ranks of quirky products, seeking to stand out in a market saturated with options. Its neon colored packaging and the promise of a uniquely sweet and bubbly experience contributed to its appeal, especially among the younger demographic. While the Hubba Bubba Soda may not have become a timeless classic, its existence serves as a nostalgic reminder of an era when boundary pushing ideas were celebrated. The beverage industry's willingness to venture into uncharted territory during the 80s laid the groundwork for the diverse array of flavors and concepts present in today's market. Number three, Aspen Soda. Aspen Soda, a once popular apple flavored beverage that graced store shelves during the 1970s, has now faded into obscurity, conspicuously absent from today's retail offerings. A nostalgic sip for those who reminisce about the bygone era, Aspen Soda holds a unique place in the history of soft drinks. Back in its heyday, Aspen Soda carved a niche for itself with its distinctive apple flavor, capturing the taste buds and preferences of consumers in the 1970s. However, despite its initial success, 
the soda gradually disappeared from the market, leaving behind a trail of fond memories. The reasons behind Aspen Soda's disappearance are multifaceted. Changing consumer preferences, evolving beverage trends, and the emergence of new competitors could have played pivotal roles in its decline. As tastes shifted and diversified, the once popular apple-flavored soda faced challenges in maintaining its relevance in an ever-changing market. While Aspen Soda may no longer have a presence on store shelves, its legacy lives on in the hearts of those who fondly recall its crisp and refreshing taste. Nostalgia often accompanies discussions about iconic brands from the past, with Aspen Soda serving as a symbol of a different era in the soft drink landscape. In recent times, there has been a resurgence of interest in retro and vintage products, and Aspen Soda has not been immune to this trend. Enthusiasts and collectors seek out remnants of this classic beverage, whether it be vintage cans, advertisements, or memorabilia, contributing to the soda's enduring cultural impact. Number four, Coca-Cola Black. When Coca-Cola Black hit the shelves, it seemed like a bold and innovative move by the beverage giant. Combining the refreshing taste of Coca-Cola with the rich flavor of coffee, it aimed to capture the attention of both soda and coffee lovers alike. However, despite its initial buzz, Coca-Cola Black failed to resonate with consumers and was eventually discontinued. Yet, Coca-Cola is not one to shy away from experimentation, and now they're back with a new take on the coffee-cola fusion. Coca-Cola with coffee. This new beverage seems like a revival of the concept behind Coca-Cola Block, but with potentially refined execution. By incorporating coffee into its classic cola formula, Coca-Cola is once again venturing into uncharted territory in the beverage industry. The idea of combining the energizing kick of coffee with the familiar sweetness of Coca-Cola is intriguing to say the least. With the rise of coffee culture and the increasing demand for convenient caffeinated beverages, Coca-Cola's decision to revisit the coffee-cola combination makes strategic sense. It taps into the evolving preferences of consumers who seek innovative and versatile drink options. Additionally, the timing seems apt, considering the growing popularity of coffee-infused products across various categories. However, the success of Coca-Cola with coffee hinges on several factors. First and foremost is taste. While Coca-Cola has a proven track record of crafting enjoyable beverages, striking the right balance between cola and coffee flavors is crucial. The drink must offer a harmonious blend that appeals to a wide audience without overpowering either element. Furthermore, effective marketing and positioning will play a significant role in determining the beverage's reception in the market. Coca-Cola needs to effectively communicate the unique selling proposition of Coca-Cola with coffee and differentiate it from both traditional cola drinks and existing coffee-based beverages. Number five, Orbit's Soda. Orbit's Soda, with its visually captivating multicolored floating balls of gelatin, was once heralded as the soda of the future. Introduced in the late 90s, it promised a unique and innovative drinking experience. The distinctive appearance, featuring suspended gelatinous spheres resembling miniature planets, immediately set Orbit's apart from traditional sodas. Despite its futuristic aesthetic, Orbit's soda faced challenges in gaining widespread acceptance. The drink's unusual texture, characterized by the presence of these floating gelatin balls, proved to be a divisive factor among consumers. While some were intrigued by the novelty, others found the texture off-putting, leading to a lack of unanimous approval. Unfortunately, the polarized reception and the failure to secure a dedicated fan base ultimately led to Orbit Soda being discontinued in the late 90s. The once promising beverage faded into obscurity, becoming a nostalgic relic for those who had briefly encountered its unique charm. Looking back, Orbit Soda serves as a reminder of the delicate balance between innovation and consumer preferences in the food and beverage industry. While the soda industry has seen numerous successful experiments and flavor variations, Orbit stands out as a quirky and daring attempt 
that didn't quite resonate with the masses. Despite its discontinuation, Orbit Soda maintains a dedicated fan base who fondly reminisce about the beverage's short-lived presence on store shelves. The nostalgia surrounding Orbitz has even led to occasional calls for its revival, showcasing the enduring impact of unique and unconventional products on consumer memory. Number six, New Coke. In 1985, Coca-Cola made a significant move by introducing its new recipe, famously known as New Coke. For those who grew up after this era, the only reference might be through popular culture, such as its appearance in the TV series, Stranger Things. However, the story behind New Coke is more than just a nostalgic pop culture reference. It's a tale of a major shift in the soft drink industry and consumer preferences. The debut of New Coke marked a bold attempt by Coca-Cola to revitalize its brand and capture a new market. However, what followed was unexpected, a backlash from loyal Coke enthusiasts who vehemently preferred the original formula. Despite extensive market research and testing that supposedly indicated a preference for the new taste, the public reaction was overwhelmingly negative. Consumers felt a deep connection to the classic Coca-Cola flavor, and the introduction of New Coke was seen as an unwelcome departure from tradition. The backlash was so intense that it led to one of the most significant marketing reversals in history. Coca-Cola responded to the outcry by bringing back the original formula rebranded as Coca-Cola Classic, just a few months after the launch of New Coke. This move was a testament to the power of consumer sentiment and the impact of a brand deeply embedded in American culture. New Coke's short-lived existence serves as a cautionary tale in the business world, emphasizing the importance of understanding and respecting consumer preferences. The incident prompted a reevaluation of marketing strategies and product development, influencing how companies approach changes to established brands. Number seven, Lifesavers Soda. Lifesavers, known for its iconic candy creations, has had its fair share of experiments and failures throughout the years. From the discontinued Creme Savers to the short-lived Lifesavers Holes, the brand has seen various products come and go. However, one of the most noteworthy failures in the brand's history is undoubtedly Lifesavers Soda. Lifesaver Soda was introduced with high hopes, but turned out to be a spectacular failure for the brand. One of its most glaring issues was its unappealing brown color, which failed to attract consumers accustomed to vibrant and enticing beverage options. The departure from the familiar and vibrant hues associated with the Lifesavers brand might have been a contributing factor to the soda's lack of success. The introduction of Lifesaver Soda was a bold move, attempting to expand the brand's reach from candies to beverages. However, the soda failed to capture the essence of the Lifesaver's brand that consumers had grown to love. The mismatch between expectations associated with Lifesavers and the underwhelming reality of the brown-hued soda created a significant disconnect in the market. Lifesaver's journey into the beverage industry with Lifesaver Soda serves as a cautionary tale in product expansion. It highlights the importance of understanding consumer expectations, maintaining brand consistency, and ensuring that new products align with the established identity. Number eight, Crystal Pepsi. Crystal Pepsi, a clear colored variation of the iconic cola, emerged as a unique and intriguing concept. However, despite its initial novelty, the beverage failed to maintain a lasting presence on store shelves. The memories of Crystal Pepsi, though fleeting in its commercial lifespan, linger as a nostalgic touchstone, particularly for those who grew up in the 90s. Introduced by PepsiCo in the early 1990s, Crystal Pepsi aimed to revolutionize the cola market by offering a transparent alternative to the traditional brown sodas. Marketed as a crystal clear, caffeine-free cola with a distinct taste, Crystal Pepsi sought to capture consumer attention through its innovative visual appeal. The beverage quickly gained attention and curiosity with consumers drawn to the idea of a soda devoid of artificial colors. However, despite initial interest, Crystal Pepsi faced challenges that led to its eventual disappearance from store shelves. 
Consumer preferences and expectations deeply rooted in the familiarity of the traditional cola color proved to be a formidable obstacle. The transparent appearance, while intriguing, failed to resonate on a broader scale and the beverage struggled to establish a loyal consumer base. Nevertheless, for those who experienced the short-lived era of Crystal Pepsi, the memory remains a distinctive part of 90s pop culture. The drink's clear aesthetic, coupled with its brief but impactful presence, serves as a reminder of the continuous evolution and experimentation within the beverage industry. The legacy of Crystal Pepsi lives on through the lens of nostalgia, sparking conversations and reminiscences among individuals who recall the excitement surrounding this innovative yet short-lived soda. Number nine, bacon soda. Once upon a time, bacon soda made its debut, captivating curious taste buds with its unconventional fusion of savory bacon flavor and fizzy carbonation. This intriguing concoction aimed to marry the smoky essence of bacon with the effervescence of soda, offering a unique sensory experience to adventurous consumers. The concept behind bacon soda likely stemmed from the widespread popularity of bacon as a versatile ingredient renowned for its rich flavor profile. By incorporating this beloved taste into a carbonated beverage, creators aim to push the boundaries of culinary innovation and tap into the adventurous spirit of consumers seeking novel flavor experiences. Despite its initial novelty, bacon soda failed to secure a lasting foothold in the beverage market. Its discontinuation may be attributed to various factors, including the polarizing nature of its flavor combination and the evolving preferences of health-conscious consumers. While some may have been intrigued by the idea of sipping on the essence of bacon, others may have found the concept too unconventional or even off-putting. Additionally, the growing emphasis on health and wellness in consumer choices may have rendered bacon soda less appealing due to concerns about its nutritional content and alignment with healthier lifestyle practices. Ultimately, bacon soda serves as a reminder of the bold experimentation that characterizes the food and beverage industry. While it may not have achieved mainstream success, its brief moment in the spotlight showcases the endless possibilities for culinary creativity and the willingness of consumers to explore new taste sensations. Number 10, Thanksgiving dinner. Soda, Jones Soda. Thanksgiving dinner soda is a unique beverage that offers the flavors of a traditional Thanksgiving dinner in a soda form. For those who have ever wished to experience the taste of Thanksgiving dinner, complete with turkey and all the side dishes throughout the year, this soda might have seemed like the perfect solution. However, to many others, the concept of Thanksgiving dinner soda might sound unappealing or even repulsive. The idea of condensing the flavors of a full Thanksgiving meal into a carbonated beverage is undoubtedly unconventional. It raises questions about the compatibility of savory flavors like turkey, mashed potatoes, and gravy with the sweetness and effervescence of soda. While some adventurous consumers might be intrigued by the novelty of such a product, others may find the concept difficult to stomach. Despite the initial skepticism surrounding Thanksgiving dinner soda, it has garnered attention for its novelty factor and unique flavor profile. Jones Soda, known for its unconventional soda flavors and limited edition releases, has attracted a niche market of curious consumers eager to try out new taste experiences. Additionally, the limited availability of Thanksgiving dinner soda adds to its allure, creating a sense of exclusivity among enthusiasts. From a marketing perspective, Thanksgiving dinner soda serves as a conversation starter and a promotional tool for Jones Soda. Its quirky concept generates buzz and media attention, further establishing the brand's reputation for innovation and creativity in the beverage industry. Moreover, the limited time availability of Thanksgiving dinner soda encourages impulse purchases and drives sales during the holiday season. While Thanksgiving dinner soda may not appeal to everyone's taste buds, its existence highlights the endless possibilities for innovation in the food and beverage industry. Whether it's a daring culinary experiment or a playful nod to tradition, products like Thanksgiving dinner soda challenge conventional notions of flavor and consumption 
inviting consumers to embrace new and unexpected taste sensations.